All right, guys, it's the Junkie. I'm back again with another video. Um, this haul video, it's pretty good, pretty good size. Um, so uh, yeah, let's get started. But first, I want to give um, a shout out to some of the people that have supported me and shouted me out in their videos. I mean, I love all my subscribers. I appreciate everybody subscribing to my channel and giving me thumbs up. I've gotten a few thumbs down. That's okay. I've learned to live with it. I know it's going to happen. Not everybody's going to like the stuff that I show. And that's cool. I understand. But um, there's some people that I like to mention. Most of these are newcomers um, that are just like me trying to get started. And I just want to give you guys a heads up on some of these channels. So go check them out. They got some really good stuff. Um, yeah, so first of all, I want to thank like um, Howler Mouse and Johnny DaCosta and Captain Strange Live. You know, those and like Tom Ryan and Vin Crew and the comic book esthete, um, Why Not Art, you know, those guys are like Adam Day, Tim Morant, um, them guys are like staples in this community. Those guys are the ones that we've watched as young YouTubers and said, you know what, I want to have, you know, I like their collections, I want to show mine off like they show theirs off, they got great videos, I mean, all of you guys have excellent videos and I watch them all I even watch old videos that are like months and months old um, I just appreciate you guys making these videos and making it to where we are able to you know come on here and show our collections in it you know and have people be able to view it and say wow it's really cool I like that so I want to thank those guys that are staples in this community that have supported me commented on my videos liked my videos um, yeah so here's a few other people honorable mentions um, Sandman Logan 5, he, his channel, he's formerly Peter Parker, I don't know if you guys remember, but he had a lot of good videos, man, and then his channel went down, I was upset, I was asking around, because I really liked his, the way he does his videos, where it's, it's almost like he's in, like, a newsroom, you know, he's got his cable, you know, his, his camera's all set up, and he's at his desk, and he's showing his books, and he gives great detail in his books, and he picks up a lot of stuff that, like, I pick up. You know, the odds and ends stuff, the, the fillers, doesn't have to be a key. You know, I don't always feel like I have to buy keys in order for my videos to be good. I just like collecting comics, so I'll buy whatever. You know what I mean? If I can find a good deal on it, I'm going to buy it. Um, but now I'm starting to want to complete runs and stuff like that. But, yeah, check Sandman Logan 5 out, formerly Peter Parker. Um, welcome back, dude. I'm glad you're making videos again. Um, keep up the good work. Um, ADHD Comics, new guy, he's, he's blowing up pretty quick, I think he's like close to 50, um, subscribers, check him out, um, High Expectation, new guy, he's got, you know, he's got like 15 viewer, 15 subscribers, go, ahead, go check his channel out, he, uh, he has comics, he does, he has a lot of cool statues, he has CGC books, go check his channel out, guys, um, uh, Cosmo Bosco 771. I love that guy, man. He's so funny. His videos are funny. He, uh, he has great reviews. Check him out. Um, Joaquin Comic Center. Check him out. He's got, you know, he's a staple too. He's been around a while. Go check his channel out. Stacy Pool S. She's relatively new. She's, you know, into Deadpool and Spider Man and, you know, stuff like that. So go check her channel out. Um,. Uh, let me see. Sorry, I got my list here. Paul Brennanen, check him out. He's been around for a while, too. Um, he's one of my brothers from over the seas. And Luke and Big Daddy Don, my Irish brothers. Um, check. I know everybody knows their channel. But these are just a few of the guys, a few of the channels, guys and gals that you know are in the comics that make videos. I should have put something up for you guys to look at while I was ranting, but... Um, yeah, go check them out, guys, and let's get started. I bought a lot of um, X-Men books, really cheap. It comes out to be about a quarter a piece. So, yeah, let's get started. It's a mix of books. It's X-Men-related re books. Um, there's X-Men 513 and X-Factor Nation, one-shot. Young X Men. I mean, this is just a mix of books. So I'm just gonna go through them. They're, you know, they're all like I said, they're all X Men related. 
Um, it was 86 books, and I got it for 20, I think 20.99, and I think it was like six dollars shipping. So, you know, I asked around. Some people include shipping in their uh, in their price. Um, I guess I'll start doing the same thing because I guess that's the consensus that just char you know, just add shipping into whatever the price of the book is. So, yeah, but I was really happy to get this lot, man. I was watching it and watching it and watching it, and then finally it, you know, it came down to it. And I was, I think I was, there was only one other bidder, and I just put in uh, twenty five bucks, and I ended up getting it for like twenty ninety nine. Really good books. A lot of them weren't bagged and boarded, so I had to do that myself. That's why I haven't taped them down yet. I just bagged them before I made this video. But, you know, it's it's a lot of different books. X-Factor, X-Men, Young X-Men, X-Men Nation, Wolverine. I got a nice little Wolverine run here with Mystique. Um... As you guys know, I like Mystique. If you haven't seen my video on her little mini on her series that I have, uh, go check it out. Yeah, I've you know there's been a few times where you know there's been I think at least one video where I haven't had doubles. Sorry guys, I don't mean to disappoint, <laughs> but you know um, a lot of my videos now I'm you know I'm trying to. I mean, if I can get doubles, I'm going to get them. But now I'm just kind of in the mood to try to complete some runs. And, you know, if there's uh, some doubles that I have that, you know, if if you've been around for a while and if me and you've been ch chatting on YouTube, I don't mind doing a trade. Um, you know, everybody had that big scare with Wayne Murdoch not sending books out, and come to find out it wasn't even his fault, it was post office, but, you know, I'm not afraid to do some trades, so guys, if you want to hit me up, um, let me know what you're interested in, and if I want to, you know, the hard thing about trading with me is, not only do I love collecting, but I, I feel like these comics are like a part of my life, I, I hate to part with them. And that's the downside for me, you know, because I could trade a lot of my doubles off and complete a lot of runs, but I don't know. I just feel I, I'm, I'm attached to them. I know it sounds weird, but this X-Force run right here with the Dark X-Men, these covers, man, I love them. I mean, right there, that's, 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 just, that's just bad. And here's two I forgot to... I didn't realize they weren't in bags and boards. Um, I got that. That's all from one seller. Like I said, I got that for like 21 bucks. Pretty happy. Anytime you can pick up X-Men books for that cheap, I'm down. Also, I got this relatively cheap. And I just bought on eBay last night almost a complete run. But Godzilla... King of the Monsters, number one. This book, man, I don't know. I don't know what's the big deal. I mean, I know it's Godzilla, but, man, trying to buy this online, it's like 20, 30 bucks. But I got this one for, I think, seven, and then $4 shipping, so $11. It's in pretty good shape. There's no real major dings or, or you know, the corners are in good shape. Um, yeah, so I put that in Mylar. And then... I had ordered these online, and it's just nothing big, relatively new stuff. Wolverine and the and the X Men, the Logan Legacy number three, and number one. My comic shop ran out of these, so I bought these online. And uh, the Death of Wolverine, Deadpool, and Captain America. I've been seeing that in a lot of videos. Pretty cool. Um, I paid less than cover price for all these books. So, and then <clears throat> you know you. You guys know that I've been trying to get into DC a little bit. So I bought from the same seller. They had this on there. Forever Evil. Um, the New 52. So I got one through six. Pretty cool. I just I woke up this morning. I had to go to post office and pick these up. 
But yeah, guys, I know this video is a little longer than normal, but I wanted to give some shout-outs to people that have supported me. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. I think I'm up to 109, 110 subs. So as soon as my 50 sub contest is over, I'll have 100 one. Um, I'm going to give away something really special, um, something really cool in my collection. Um, it's a surprise, but thanks, guys. Appreciate it. More videos to come. Junkies out.